What are the uses of ethane? Have you ever wondered about the uses of ethane, the simple yet fascinating compound with the chemical formula c 2 h 6 Ethane is a colorless, odorless, and flammable gas that plays a significant role in various industries. Let's break down its uses and see how it fits into the world of chemistry. First off, one of the primary uses of ethane is as a feedstock for producing ethylene. Ethylene is created through a process called steam cracking, where ethane is heated with steam. This process breaks ethane down into ethylene and other byproducts. Ethylene is essential in making plastics, detergents, and automotive antifreeze. Next, ethane is also a component of natural gas. It can be used as a fuel for power generation. When burned, ethane produces more energy per volume than methane, making it a cleaner option for some applications. This makes it a practical choice for energy production. Another interesting application of ethane is in refrigeration. Thanks to its low boiling point, ethane is suitable as a refrigerant in cryogenic systems. These systems are vital in fields like medicine, food production, and even rocketry, where temperature control is crucial. Moving on to more advanced applications, ethane is involved in chemical synthesis. It is used to create compounds like ethanol, acetaldehyde, and acetic acid. These substances are important in producing paints, varnishes, adhesives, and various plastics. In scientific research, liquid ethane has a unique role. It is used to vitrify water-rich samples for cryo-electron microscopy. This technique helps preserve the structure of biological samples by freezing them rapidly without forming ice crystals, which can damage the samples. Ethane also serves as a marker for lipid peroxidation, a process that indicates oxidative stress in biological systems. This application is particularly useful in biological and medical research. In the context of chemical nomenclature, ethane is a great example for students learning about systematic names, also known as International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry Names. The name ethane comes from the prefix eth, which signifies to carbon atoms, and the suffix ain, indicating single bonds. This naming convention helps students grasp how to systematically name hydrocarbons. By studying ethane, students can better understand how chemical compounds are utilized in different industries. Ethane's various applications highlight the importance of chemical structures and reactions in real-world scenarios. So, the next time you hear about ethane, Remember it is more than just a simple gas. It is a key player in many essential processes.